In the history of Ultimate Team, we've had some amazing silver cards. Welcome to a challenge, it's called Best of the Rest. In the history of the AFCON competition, Burundi have never qualified. And now... in Burundi. Okay, so they speak French, but there's also Kurundi. I typed in English to Kurundi, which is the third, which is one of the languages in Burundi, and it's it's just saying nuts in English. Nuts. Nuts. Umusazi means crazy person. It could also mean mad, lad. This guy looks like an absolute Umusazi. Boss something, boys, and happy Monday. Hopefully, you guys' this week is getting off to a great start. I don't know if you guys can tell by the look on my face. I'm a little bit pink. I'm a little bit under the weather. Um, currently dealing with a little bit of a cold. It looks like it's going around here in Miami, but uh, dealing with a little bit of a cold. But that doesn't stop us from putting together an emotional epi featuring a player Nothing new that we got. It's a player that we got last Wednesday. It is none other than Cedric Amissi, the only player representing Burundi. They've qualified for the AFCON for the first time uh, in their history for a 1-1 draw versus, I believe, Gabon. Uh, sorry, no, not, not Gabon. Who was it? Was it... Uh... No, they scored in a 1-1 draw versus someone to qualify Burundi for the first AFCON ever in their history. That's why he got this hero card. He has 326 total in-game stats over his base 64 bronze card. What? Let me repeat that. 326 total in-game upgrades. 326. That's this month. 326 total in-game stat upgrades over a 64 base card, uh, 64 bronze base card, which leaves him as a silver player, as a 74 rated card. If you guys can remember a silver card that looks crazier than this. 85 stamina, uh, 78 strength, 86 jumping, turns into an in-game, he turns into an 84 rated striker with the sniper chem style, 78 agility, we've boosted that, already has 90 balance, has decent heading accuracy with 72, and then finishing goes up, shot power, long shots, Volleys, penalties, his shooting, and then pace as well. Look at that. 82 acceleration, 86 sprint speed. Uh, just looks like an absolute treat. Now, the only downside is, depending if you look at this as a downside, I don't because I love the I love the Dariel Jimmy League, the Saudi League. We have thrown him into a pretty much full Saudi League side featuring the likes of that League SBC Musa and then also Omar Al-Suma and then also Omar Abdul Rahman with his teammate Al-Sharani. And then a couple undervalued uh, cheap beasts, if you will, in the form of Souza. And then the Irish legend himself, Sanoko Sanogo. And then, of course, we're going to link it with his other Irish compatriot, uh, Serge Arie. But this is a pretty fun-looking squad. Again, I like... This is more the sort of stuff that I like to do on the channel. If you guys are hyped for this Jackson Martinez flashback card, if you guys want to see me do an epi on that tomorrow, which, uh, assuming that that's what it is, uh, you guys need to hit that like button. Let me know if you guys do want to see that in the comment section below. Also, don't forget to let me know what you think the craziest silver card was in ultimate team history if you guys are new to the channel hit that subscribe button down below but i told you guys uh we put the sniper cam style on him i'm gonna have omar Osuma as my cam because i think he's better suited there uh a missy obviously has decent passing stats but really i think he's better as a uh i think he's better as a striker i mean look at these cards look at this card five eight three star three star so he's kind of like messi-esque in the sense that he uh, is, is very, very short, but 12,250 coins. I mean, talk about stats per coin value. The new foot swap actually looks really sick. It's 14 tokens for a base icon, uh, untradeable base icon SBC. Well, uh, uh, I can't talk right now. A baby. Divert, yeah. 14 tokens for a base icon, which I think is actually pretty cool. If you don't get anything good in that, you just swap it into one of the icon SBCs and you get a 300k pack. So I think that's really sweet. And then I think it's three foot swap items for an 87 inform. Clivert, yeah! Clivert, That better be the... That's not. It's not the base icon, Clivert. Serge Aurier. He's got that... He's got that side locked down. Oh, Missy's on. Send it in. Oh, that's a good jump goal! Let's go! Come on! I think he moved a little bit. Ahmed Musa, he's not gonna miss that chance. Yo, Africa to, Africa to glory, that 97 pace madman. King of Africa. How does he, like, dude, how does that go in? Bro, I wish I could take free kicks like that. That was actually sick.
Cedric a missy. He's not going to miss that. Am I right? Jesus Christ. 326 total in-game stats. Seriously, guys. Is there a better silver inform card? Is there a better silver card in FIFA history? Look at Rudiger. Fair play to this guy. He scored an absolute thunder cunt with, uh, with that Pepe. As of right now, I'm pretty happy with the performance of the team. Came up Coming up against a much better rated squad in, in the form of our opponent. Let's see if we can get in the second half. Let's see if we can pull off our victory. Let's see if we can actually win with, uh, with an 84 striker or a Missy. Oh, we're out rough bun. That's what he's got, bro. There are bugs everywhere. There are bugs legitimately everywhere, dude. I feel like... I feel like this guy can score at will. I feel like this guy can legitimate, legitimately score whenever he wants. God damn it. Ooh, that's a good job! Speechless! 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 Oh, that's what they that was a red <laughs> wait. That was a red time finish with the uh, Arabian David Luiz. His distance shooting is actually it's 99 long shots, 99 shot power uh, to be exact. His distance shooting is lethal. <laughs> Omar Abdul Rahman with the 5-4 with the fifth goal. He gets up to his hatty. He is the fourth inform that we featured in all of FIFA 19. Uh, I think literally a week and a half, two weeks in. Uh, it was like two weeks into to FIFA 19 and we featured his ultimate scrim card when it got released. He has been filthy for us anytime we've used him. He's got the body fake, but more importantly, he's got the finishing and he's got that dude. His card is just nuts. Nuts. He's, I, he just might go down as my favorite value card. 13,000 coins for a card with those stats. So Omar Abdul Rahman kind of overshadowing, uh, kind of overshadowing a Missy Zeppi because it technically should be his. Why are my guys getting caught out like that? Do I have a set? Like what? David Luiz. Match number one with the Beast from Burundi and it is more so an indictment on Omar Abdul Rahman's talents. Uh, Ahmed Musa with the breakaway here. Beautiful, beautiful finish. Blast it right through Gigi Buffon and not often would you expect a Saudi League, uh, a Saudi League side to put five goals through that GG Buffon. Now he does get himself an assist. He does get himself a goal. The goal that he did score was uh, was a thing of beauty. Let's see see if they uh, if they captured the highlight there. Uh, no, they don't. Only four goals. Wait, only five goals. Match number two. Let's see if maybe a Missy can step up to the plate. Or is there going to be another Omar, Ab Omar Abdul Rahman masterclass? Match number two. A 185 rated squad with Kutrone. He's got himself a pretty nice looking side there. Um, and then Nick just tweeted out 15 years together and still as cringy as ever. Oh, I want to throw up, but I want to throw up in, the, in, in a beautiful way, dude. That's great. I love, dude. Nick and Nick and Nick and Steph are great, dude. Nick and Steph are absolute mad lads. <laughs> Messi. Oh. Oh, yeah, he's gonna make it. Let's go. Come on. That was the deal breaker. That would have made or broken the episode. Yeah, had he missed that, it would have been done deal. I would have thought he was a fake 74 rated card. But a Missy blasts away with pace that looks like it exceeded 85. And his Nigerian uh, continental mate. What do you call someone that's from the same continent as you? Continent mate? Look at that finish. Thing of beauty. Bottom left hand corner. Come on, boys. I mean, it's Hullet, right? So, okay, it makes sense. Come on, oh, Zay! Come on! Wait, what? Yo, this is labeled the best silver card in history, but this might just be the best low-rated gold card in history as well. 77 rated with these stats? Like, what is this game? Ah, god damn it. All right, too much clutter. Too much clutter in the box. Now, whether or not we score a hat trick or do something insane with a Missy in this game, is it going to answer whether or not he's the best silver in Ultimate Team history? I think a lot of that that is objective, but if we go by stats, I don't think you can make an argument that there is a better... 
I don't think you can make an argument that there is a better silver card that we've ever gotten in terms of total stats. During, like, Euros and, and Copa America and Africa, it'd be cool if, like, African players linked to African players. It'd be cool if, you know, South American players got a yellow link, or maybe even, like, just a little bit of a stronger link into their uh, continental compatriots, if that makes sense. That'd be, that'd be really, really sweet. I miss it. Far post. Far post! Come on, boys! 2-1! Amissi to Ahmed Musa, the African kings rise and uh, get us the uh, the one up on this this 90 this 90 icon hole. It a beautiful finish. I knew the moment it left the Missy's foot, I was like, you know what? It's going in. <laughs> Come on! Oh, that would have maybe been the game sealer. Cedric Amissi, the only the only player from Burundi, and he's got a 74 rated hero card, man. That is magical. That's so cool. I love seeing that sort of stuff in foot. FIFA, FIFA points, points. FIFA, FIFA points, points. FIFA, FIFA points, points. FIFA, FIFA, FIFA points, points. FIFA, FIFA points, points. I just had the weirdest FIFA case points, of deja vu. Cotrona scoring points, that goal, points, I just legitimately FIFA, had the weirdest FIFA case of deja vu. Points, FIFA, FIFA points, points. It's, anytime you have the caliber of players he has, it just takes uh, just takes one turn. It just one, it takes one turn of fortune to revert. Oh man, good goal, good build up play. It was a good goal. Hello. And that's going to be game Cedric Amissi. You know what? There's no chance in heck that we don't give him a thumbs up. He's 12,000 coins. He's in the Saudi Arabian League. He is the only player from Burundi. And he's a hero card that helped uh, Burundi qualify for the ever, first ever AFCON in their entire history. So you know what? Hell yeah, we're going to give it a thumbs up. Uh, is he the best silver in, in foot history? That is to be determined. You could make a case 100% that he is. 84 rated striker uh, rating is what he gets with the sniper chem style. So I don't know. That is the question of the epi. I asked that at the start. Uh, what other silver players in Ultimate Team history would rival a card like 74 Amissi. He's an absolute umusazi. But that is going to do it for this Monday episode. Here. Hopefully you guys have enjoyed. Was kind of happy that nothing big came out today because I did want to do this epi since last Wednesday uh, once this card came into packs. Uh, and I'm happy that we were able to do a mini featurette slash player review on him. So uh, if you guys try him out, let me know on Twitter. Let me know in the comments. Uh, let me know on Instagram uh, if you guys managed to get some success using this card. If you want to take on that Saudi uh, Dalriel Jamil League challenge. If you guys did enjoy the epi, drop a like on the video. If you guys are new to the channel, Hit that subscribe button down below, boys. Appreciate the support as always. Till next time, my bros. Tschüss. Later. Adios.